Hello and welcome to the first informational meeting regarding the solid waste service fee. My name is Elizabeth Sorad and I'm the sustainability coordinator for the City of Lafayette. In today's meeting, we're going to be providing an overview of the three cart program, the benefits of this program. We're also going to be reviewing what is the solid waste service fee and who the fee applies to and what it looks like to transition into the city's three cart program. In 2014, City Council adopted a pay-as-you-throw program structure. This structure incentivizes residents to recycle and compost as much as possible while minimizing the material that goes into your garbage cart and eventually to our local landfill. The rate you pay depends on the size of garbage cart. The larger the garbage cart, the more expensive the rate will be. In 2020, Council expanded the three-cart program which utilizes the pay-as-you-throw structure. This expansion included allowing compost to be accessible to all residents. So if you don't have compost service right now and are interested in subscribing to the service, please reach out to your current service provider or your homeowner association to opt in to this voluntary service. The expansion also gave a three year grace period to those homeowner associations who decided to opt out of the three cart program. That three year grace period ends in November of 2023. Those homeowner associations still opting out of the three cart program at that point will receive a monthly solid waste service fee. And this year, City Council approved of a new residential solid waste contract with our partner Republic Services that starts in October. As I mentioned, City Council approved a new residential solid waste contract earlier this year with our partner Republic Services. This enhanced three cart program will have embedded rates, meaning that there will be a single rate based on your garbage size following the pay as you throw structure and residents can choose their size for recycling and choose their size for compost and their rate will not change. For example, if a resident has a 32 gallon compost cart and would like to increase that cart to a 96 gallon, they can do so without any fees or added rates um, to their monthly bill. The three cart program will also offer weekly compost collection. This is something our residents have asked for and we are so excited to start offering this with the new contract starting this October. Residents will also have the option to choose smaller recycling carts in order to fit all three carts inside their garage or other locations where they're stored. Residents will also have the option for Christmas tree removal during the months January through March. Republic Services will collect undecorated and unflocked Christmas trees around four feet in size. If you just place curbside, they will collect as compost. Republic Services also has several community events, such as a compost giveaway that will be hosted around April, bulky item collection event where residents can place up to 10 bulky items curbside during this annual event for free, Bulky items are like a couch, a chair, those larger items that don't fit inside your cart. Residents will also be able to participate in a hard to recycle event to get rid of light bulbs, batteries, styrofoam, plastic film, electronics, scrap metal, household cleaners, free of charge um, on, it, on this annual event. There will also be a biannual leaf and branch collection where residents can place up to 10 bags of material out on the curb for collection, as well as five bundles of branches. Lastly, there's also a quarterly bulk item that you can place curbside for free. This is uh, separate from the annual bulky item collection event. These are just some of the enhancements and benefits that residents will be able to take advantage of with the three cart program. You may be asking yourself, why is the city encouraging residents and homeowner associations to join the three cart program? 
As I mentioned earlier, there is one rate for garbage recycle and compost collection service starting this October. Residents can choose their recycling and compost cart sizes without having any financial impact on their monthly rate. Their rate completely depends on the garbage cart size. The smaller garbage cart that you have, the smaller the rate. The larger the garbage cart, the more expensive the rate will be. There will also be fewer trucks coming in and out of neighborhoods in Lafayette. This will help with air pollution, noise pollution, and also help with traffic. Having everyone on the same program will help keep costs low across our community. It will also ensure equal access to all of the programs similar to the compost giveaway event that we host annually. It supports the city's waste diversion goals, so how well can we recycle and compost and reduce the amount of material going to the landfill? And last but not least, residents who opt into the three cart program would not have to pay the solid waste service fee. So what is the solid waste service fee? The fee will be a monthly charge that will be added to the Lafayette water utility bills of residents who decide to opt out of the city's three cart program starting in November of 2023. In November 2023 and in December of 2023, the solid waste fee will be $15.63. The solid waste fee will increase each year on January 1st based on the local Denver Aurora Lakewood Consumer Price Index or CPI. CPI is based on several uh, different elements, including inflation, standard of living, and it, the fee will increase based on a 12 month average from uh, the year before. There is no way to predict what this fee will be starting January 1st of 2024, as economic modeling uh, is volatile and hard to predict. Who will the fee apply to? So Lafayette residents who decide to opt out or HOAs that decide to opt out of the city's three cart program will be issued the fee starting in November of 2023. Prior to joining the city's three cart program, we request alongside with our partner Republic Services some information from your HOA. We do ask for a three month lead time. There's a lot of communications, logistics, and other details that need to be worked on prior to services beginning in your community. For example, a complete list needs to be turned in that lists addresses of individual homes or buildings or groups, depending on how your uh, water meter is set up in your HOA. On that same list, please indicate what your cart size selection is, whether that's individuals or buildings or group choice. Once that is turned in, Republic Services will mail out communication to residents. This will include information on your collection day, what to put in each cart, when cart swaps will occur, and also have a calendar of when your recycling and when your compost cart will be serviced. After this is completed, your services will begin and your residents will be able to call Republic Services directly to change their cart size, report a missed collection, ask questions, etc. Thank you for attending the informational meeting regarding the solid waste fee. Please note that we will be hosting more informational meetings later this year and also in 2023. We want to ensure that there is no confusion over the solid waste fee uh, that will be implemented in November of 2023. If you have any questions, please contact us at sustainability at lafayetteco.gov. We would be happy to attend a board meeting to answer any questions and ensure that, that there is no confusion over the solid waste fee. Thank you again.